Hello? Hello? Oh shit. So, as a video editor that I am, a lot of the time I need computational power because edits take a lot of time to do, you know? You just hit the render button and then you go away for like 10 hours and something happens, by then you get a video. I don't know how that works. Either way, during that time, you can't really do a lot in your PC. So, what I thought about today was, why not go on Wish.com and see what kind of a PC we could build from parts from that website. My biggest fear is that I go to the website and it's just straight up sex toys and I'll get back. So what should my budget be? I'm not gonna leave that up to you. I don't wanna spend over $500. So what do we need to build a PC? We need a case, motherboard, CPU, GPU, RAM, hard drive, PSU. So this is the list of stuff we need. Let's start with CPU. Holy shit. Um, I mean, this is, what is this? What the f is this? HD screen, 4G dual cam- What is 4G dual cameras? Okay, 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 I'm getting sidetracked. 26? This, uh, this does look like a CPU. Core 2 quad. Ooh, I mean, it's 100% working. All right, what is this? Ryzen 3. I'm looking at PC part picker and it goes for $110. This is $150. What? Have I been scammed? I thought everything was cheap and fake. These are more expensive than you can normally get. But what is this? i5? Okay, it's old. Doesn't mean it's not working. Might go with this, you know? This is actually... yeah. So I guess we need to find a um, motherboard next. Check out this cool dog. Damn, that is a cool dog. This thing? Motherboard. Oh shit, it is a motherboard. What? Have you ever played the hit game Among Us? Yeah, okay, no. Is this a smaller one? This kind of seems quite tiny. Yeah, I think this is it. Let, let's look at the GPU. 730 for 160 euros, man. I sold my 1080 for uh, 100. 1050 Ti. This most likely isn't gonna be a 1050 Ti for the price range. Okay, I'm gonna set it on the side. Now this is... This says 4Gs, not gigabytes. The pic says one gigabyte. What, does it? <laughs> it does. It does say one gigabyte. Okay, we do have a graphics card then. Fine, this is good. Yes. Should we go with case next? RAM first? God damn, fine. I wanted to get this under 10, but I mean... Oh, this is so sad. All of this. Is this a butt? No, this not. Okay, we got we got the memory. We got the memory. Let's move on. Yeah, PSU doesn't need like much, does it? Oh, fuck off. Thousand. What? Oh, this is not correct. Oh, this is wrong. Let's, let's see if we can get at least 500. Oh, it's 500 watts. This doesn't look good. This just doesn't look good. I'm, I'm, I'm just scared. Let's add this to the bucket list. What next? Let's go with HDD. Let's get the cheapest hard drive we can physically get. Oh my. God. So there's one euro difference between 80 gigabytes and two terabytes. <sighs> oh, oh, this is fine. I don't care. This is way too expensive for it, but I don't care. What the f is this? Why is this counting down? You don't, you don't see it behind the chat right now, but these things are counting down. I have like 30 minutes left. What happens? PC case. <gasps> for 40. They made it look like a PC case. <laughs> this is a I hate it. I don't want to. Full case. Let's go mother mother motherland case. But it has lots of oh okay fine. Yeah, let's go with this. I don't care. I'm doing up. So we have all of these seven parts. Order summary. 373 euros? Oh, with shipping. Oh thank god. I'll report back in a month. That was the transition. <clears throat> what is Welcome to Muran Tech Tips. First tip, don't build a PC out of parts you bought from Wish. Uh, everything arrived? <sighs> Not really, okay. It was the CPU cooler. Instead of, you know, scrapping this whole video, I bought this, an Intel stock cooler, second hand. There was one other thing that um, after buying, the seller told me, no, we're not gonna deliver it, which was the PC case. So instead, oh, this nice. is a $100 PC case. That's the only two issues I ever faced. This is the motherboard with one cable for the hard drive and no more cables. Do I need more cables? This is the <laughs> PSU. Why not? Wait, are there cables? Wait, there's no power cable. I don't have a power cable. Okay, so we have a nice NVIDIA GeForce GT130. Ah, oh, <laughs> we are saved. Thank fucking God. So for my actual uh, PC, the one that I use, I have a power cable. Look, oh, dude, okay, you need to get out of here. Say hello to everybody. Hello. Wait, how do we start? With the motherboard, I guess. Not gonna lie, this looks kinda good. To be honest, I've never built a PC before, so it'll be uh, interesting. 
Let me get the CPU out. Oh, it's even packaged nicely with like the little uh, package that you ca should eat. Looking forward to that as a dessert. Yep. Okay, there's supposed to be... Ah, here it is. Maybe that's how they build it. Right, so just... Uh... Oh, that doesn't feel good. Okay, what is usually next? Um, no, let's put the memory in first, then do the cooler. Oh, thank God it fits. Oh, this was fine. This is fine. I guess the CPU cooler next. Oriented by the fan cable. Okay, let me just yoink this in. Uh, this way, I think. Yeah. Okay, I'll push it down and... Oh! Boom. Now that was a satisfying clicks. All right, should be fine. Here it is. Look at this. Oh, it has like this little polygon. Oh my God, it's with magnets. It just opens up. Mine is with these little fucking screws. Dude, this is so much better. I wish I had this. Yeah, how's the view now? This is so much better, right guys? You, you enjoy. Oh my God, it has cables. It's so small. Come on, go in. Why does it seem to absolutely not fit? It's screwed in. Doesn't move. Yeah, let's see. Does it move? Nope. Seems perfectly fine. Okay, let's put in the PSU. Let's try to connect it to the motherboard, I guess. If the fan is connected to the motherboard, then I don't need to worry about that. I'm not happy when stuff doesn't click. I mean, it's in. All right, let's do hard drive. I can just put it in the back. Okay, let me, let me remove this. Ah, nice. Oh. Oh, look at this. Have you ever seen a graphics card alive during these times, these hard times? Bro, I'm just gonna use this PC to mine. Mine every day. <laughs> Minecraft, daddy. It just needs a little... Oh, those are creaking sounds. Yeah, okay. And screwing this in. This is fine, I don't care. Everything is in order. It should have no reason not to boot. So let's connect this. All right. Um, thank you guys for joining. It didn't go in easily at all. If I press the button, it should work, right? Well, oh, fuck. oh shit, it has RGB. The fan on the back is RGB. I think I put the power button in the wrong socket. I had to press the restart button. That's what started it. Let me get a monitor. Oh my God, the fan is so shit. I can see it wobbling. Uh, also, it's not working. Laptop is connected. So the cable is working. The monitor is working. The PC isn't working. There were a lot of issues, but now it's fixed. Look at this magnificent beast. Quickly. The amount of noise this thing makes is on par with a server rack. Why didn't it work before? It was because of this. J just broken. Doesn't work. I got Windows 10 installed, and then I found the right drivers manually. You had to install and I don't those. Know, weird I, I thought it was I like different to install. It or of those drivers. I did it. Yes. Like, and the PC never started again. So yeah, the, it, it's a fake GPU. Th this PC has no reason to exist. But today, we find out how much we can't use it for anything. First of all, I want to see how good it holds up on the productive side. First of all, let's try Premiere Portable, which I didn't know is a thing. Also, as you can see, it's kind of slow. The main thing I really wanted to change was the disc. This is the biggest bottleneck on the PC. Oh, oh shit! It's starting up. Holy fish. Wait, I don't have any video footage. I didn't expect to get this far. I'm Beethoven? What? Right, let's let's skip this step for now. I also have, you know, Blender. Let's see how that works. Oh, <gasps> it opens? Bro, no way. Okay, let's close Premiere. Oh, okay, okay, default cube. <gasps> okay, let's try to build something. Give me an item. I want to see how long it takes. I'll do a mug. So let's delete the default cube. Uh, let's do a cylinder. Blender works surprisingly well. I'm happy. You can do light blending on this one. So next up, let's try Photoshop. Let's try to do a very basic thumbnail. So I'm going to download three assets. C-Dog VA, Joey, and let's do a nice background. This far, there's not a lot of lag here. Oh, this is an older Photoshop, so some stuff doesn't work like I'm used to. What the f was that? Okay, th there are some graphical glitches. I mean, can't really do anything about that. To top it off, let's add text. And bam, we got a YouTube thumbnail. A one-to-one -one recreation of a YouTube thumbnail that every clipper uses, you know? Next up, can it play YouTube videos? Uh, I mean, yeah. 
it works. You see this with a lag, but that's because I've set Discord to send 15 frames per second instead of 30. I set it to 1080p and yeah, there's no issues with it. Let's try 4K. Okay, okay, it's definitely dropping some frames. I'm gonna say it's watchable. And finally, gaming. So let's start off with the oldest ones. Duke Nukem, how well does it run? Whoa, now this is 60 FPS. I am so sorry for you guys because it looks so bad for you. Oh, this is playable. Oh, this is even too much. I'm gonna call this a success. Old games, smooth. Let's try something new. Hotline Miami next. Okay, menu. Right now, looking exceptional. Oh shit, this looks working much. Whoa, this is working. It runs. This is so much better than I thought. Damn, the music uh, brings back so much memories. Oh shit, okay. That's good enough. This was a pleasant experience. Holy shit. Next up, let's do Terraria. Right, let's try single player new. Ooh, oh. Okay, this is bad. Yeah, this is unplayable. This game plays at 30% per speed. Oh, settings, video, quality, low. Nope. It's, it slightly became better, but not really. Terraria, ah, uh, that, actually bad. All right, so this is one of my favorite games of all time. Tower of Guns. Also, this uses Unreal Engine 3. This is weird. It runs almost okay. I'd say 20 to 30 frames, but there's a huge lag between moving the mouse and it actually moving. I mean, yeah, this is a, this is an experience. This is a shitty experience, but it is an experience. Let's quit. Let's do crap game. It came out this year. Oh, oh my god. Mm, let's do let's do less. You know, let's do 300 by 200. Crap smoother. I can barely read anything, but it runs smoother. What you're seeing right now on your screen is what I'm seeing. Let's see how it is. Um, this looks like a mini clip game. It's straight up unplayable. Yeah, no, no, no. And now for the final challenge, Ghost Runner. How will this handle? I kind of know the answer already. It doesn't. That, that's it. So here we have it. The Wish PC. We tried to be productive. Premiere worked. Photoshop worked. Blender worked. We can watch videos on YouTube. And older games also worked. But you know, at least I have a nice little shelf over here for all of my G Fuel gamer subs. Just use code don't buy this because this causes you heart issues. In conclusion, don't buy this. We got it to work. The video is over. Sell it on your subathon? That's an actually good idea. All right, cool. Thank you for joining on this incredible wish adventure, which I, uh, okay, it wasn't incredible. Let me know in the comments down below, what should I do with this PC? Either way, subscribe to see what might happen to it or follow me on Twitch, cause I'm probably gonna stream what's gonna happen to it in the future. Hope you had a fun time, unlike me. And uh, 